guys we are in roswell and i just want you guys to first look at these little oh i'm sorry i'm gonna show them the lamp i was all like <laughs> man that's some myself. air that's some air <laughs> is it really yeah that is really good air look at it. So here's your little thing that you liked. I did. Look at this guys. Oh, it's so cool. Bottomless lake. Yep. See? Bottomless lake. Oh, look, there's my birthday, June 29th. Come join us for the 10th anniversary. 70th. Seven. Oh, wow. Imagine that scrapbook. Adela found something amazing. Look at that. You can see a whole like piece of written story. I love it. To yeah. fall off into I like this. I love all of these. Right? Look at that. <laughs> well, cool. Darling, hello, darling. Be happy, darling. Darling, oh, we oh found my, my God, darling. That's yours. <laughs> we found my darling. <laughs> that's so you. That is so me. <laughs> oh, I love it. Ooh. Oh, yes. I just got I just got a call from Fred like I know I'm into fashion designer and Oh I, are you? Yeah and I'm like and then we just got by it's like I'm losing my mind. Oh. Like, and this is what is your fabric and, and then just what all did you just oh, everything. everything. Um, my favorite thing is avant-garde um 
gowns or just just different and unique pieces. Uh -huh. um, a lot of my pieces I use um, fabrics that are either from. Um, oh, if you have any remnants. You're gonna throw away. No, okay. Um, so that's what I do. I go around my local stores. I'll collect their remnants uh -huh. and you know ask if I can have their scraps and then make pieces and that out of my so scraps. Um, and so You're actually making my dress from yeah, I mean, recycled material. Yeah. Because it works. I knew what yeah. I was doing. So. And they asked you, how do you do it? Well, you gotta have the mind. Like, yeah, I just. I can't tell you. <laughs> well, that's when, when he asked me, one of the questions was, like, how do you? And I was like, look, dude, I see it in my head, and I take the fabric that I know I see, I put it there, I pin it, it's done. Like, I. Right. I can't tell you any other way that that is what it is. That's the line, that's the piece, that's how I want it, and that's it. Exactly. That's so perfect. Good. So yeah, I absolutely enjoy it. So thank you for showing me that because that is beautiful. Oh, and then... Oh, there's a bar right there too. Same. Meet each other's. Get tea and so fast. Oh, so oh. Hello, Roswell. Oh, look at these little shoes right there. Oh, they're so adorable. Look at these. Oh my god. Stay focused and extra sparkly. She's gonna do that the whole time. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna do it. So I'm okay. I'm just very Not expressive. We can hear a lot of that. A lot of times we don't get that many people coming here and we be kind of. I'm in an appreciation of art. That's true, exactly. <laughs> I'm gonna get Lee a rock. All right. Everybody's gotta have a rock. And in this case, an alien rock.
Are you from Morocco? No. No? Okay. I'm good thing working uh, here. Oh, okay. You know, we have time, so we are exploring this beautiful city. Oh, good. Are you from Morocco? Yes, I am. Beautiful bird. I think I saw one of those at the bottom. Was a like grackle. It. Yeah, we have lots of them. A lot of people don't like them, but I've always liked them. Are they the ones making the loud squeak? Yes, yes. they make lots of rackets. And what are you painting with? Um, acrylic. I do have a degree. You do? Yes, I oh, wanted to be a teacher. Wish I, wish I had but gotten my degree. I turned I turned into a photographer instead. Yes? Yeah. So do, are you on Instagram or Facebook yes. or any of that? Yeah, I can give you my yeah, card. Yes. Can I you know. tell? I didn't even wear makeup. You look fantastic. <laughs> How awesome because my whole mission is to empower women. So well, allow me to empower are. you. <laughs> Can I share your information with my viewers? Yes. What are you are you a blogger? Mm hmm Just say your name right there. I'm Peggy Krantz and I started painting when I was 47. So I thought people were either born to be artists or not, and so I didn't have a natural talent. So I never dabbled in it until I was old enough to have some time and I taught myself how to paint and draw. And now I have a gallery. My husband and I own this building here in Roswell and we house uh, and the, the Roswell Fun Art League. So now 27 other artists get to make a living in this building too. So it's just been a wonderful journey and art has just enhanced my life so much. Mm, beautiful. So, and where can they find your own Instagram? Yeah, Peggy Krantz Art is um, where I am on Instagram and on Facebook. So, go check out this beautiful gallery. And if you're in the Roswell area, they do have classes. I saw. Yes. And they're so kind to let us film in here. We get to see this one of the kind. And this is a what bird again? He's a grackle. A grackle. Mm -hmm. He must be a juvenile grackle. And so his feathers aren't completely, because I've seen them, you know, they have longer feathers and they're really big birds. And but they make a lot of racket and they play so much. And so they've always just been a favorite of mine. So I thought I would honor him in a pink. <laughs> I love it. Thank you, Peggy. Thank you. Let's get back to this beautiful gallery. Mm -hmm. oh, look at that little kid, too. I love these little kids. I have a GoPro in this video I'm taking. <laughs> I think maybe I found one of these pictures for Priscilla. Oh, <laughs> I don't want to get that one. Oh, she would like that one. All right, and look, you were just talking about Einstein. Yep. She didn't say, well, not yet. Where did you find that little... I got it. I love that it's all local artists too. Kind of winding down because I'm 87. 
Oh, wow. And uh, this is some of my watercolors here. I oh. paint miniatures, too. Oh, my God. You love the colors. I do, too. Oh, my God. It kind of grew as... This is Doris. She's 87. <laughs> and this is her work. Stunning. This caught me. That this. got you. I wouldn't ever want to send that out. I'd keep it. Yeah, I've done that too, and I still do. You have some beautiful talent, Miss Doris. Now, what got you started in watercolors? I'm always interested in what medium. Okay, the, the real thing is my husband, I was already painting, but I was doing oils. And uh, so he, for Christmas, he gave me a... A little starter set of watercolors, brushes, and everything. Mm -hmm. We took off together. <laughs> we took off together. I <laughs> love that. That's just what happened. Some people say watercolors are very, very difficult, and they won't do them mm -hmm. because they don't understand. It never happened to me that way. Oils are difficult. Oh my gosh. I think so too. Yeah. I've not dabbled in watercolors. I've dabbled in acrylics, but I just really love the oils. I think I like the smell more than anything, but I, I love getting the palette knife and just piling the, I want it to be touched, so. Yeah. But you can build up watercolors also, yes? With different um, you, with mixed la genres. With glazes, yes, yeah. you can. That's what they call it, I think, is layer after layer is glazing. Mm. You can do that, and that kind of happens there. This is just my, I love this. That just grew as, it, oh no, made the base first, I think. Beautiful. Can I have one of your card stores, or do you have one? Yes, you do. There. Thank you. I sold that painting. Oh. Yeah. Well, back. <laughs> Not from Florida, bought it. First <laughs> kitchen, he said. Can you We're imagine? Florida. We are from Florida. Right here. This is my work here too. Well, you're just full of surprises. Look at you. This one. This is beautiful. Too. Is this yours too? These are mine. Mm -hmm. oh, wow. Get out of your way here. I'm gonna take this and see. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think I'm gonna buy this kitty cat because it reminds me of. Oh, it's beautiful. I know. It reminds me of mouth. Oh my God! Jump! You have an iPhone. That was not that hard. Not that hard. Okay, ready? One, two, three. <laughs> A lot of reading guys.
<laughs> Thank you, boy. Oh, cut your head off. Oh, yeah. There we go. <laughs> That's so funny. This is the alien zone, guys. Look how cool this is. They were closing. So she's so super sweet. Thank you so much. You see a lot of things. Yes. Oh. We're over here. Thank you. We'll, yeah, we'll come in here. Yeah, those are the pictures there. Oh my gosh, so here we go. Then I won't be working tomorrow, but my other uh, weekend manager will, and she does my initials. So look! Free. Yes, we have to look. Cra yeah, crash site, yep. We'll have to do this. Yeah, we have to do this tomorrow. We cannot leave here without doing it. Well, we have lunch time. It's not like we need lunch. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. There you go. Oh, you rock so hard. Yeah, and I'm Jesse. And I'll let my uh, weekend manager know that you guys. Oh, perfect. Well, okay. cool. I wanted to give you this too because we're here. We're here on business. We're gonna be working awesome. tomorrow and doing the interview. So we'll stop in between. Oh, so, wow. Yeah, we're um, we we run a project called the Country Guys Project. This is the creator of Lana Hurley, and um, I we are working with him for directing all of this. Oh, cool. Um, both of our novels. So check this out. That's we're, really cool. We're, we're So yeah. make sure you guys come over yeah. here. Um, yeah, these are picture opportunities. So if you guys want to use the alien thing for any of your stuff. Oh, well then, okay, so I have a okay. question. <laughs> Let us we look have here. To have, we have parachutes. 
Okay. Like the girls, it's a dress, that's uh -huh. their thing, right? So no would we be shoes. able to okay. right, bring in a parachute and put it like maybe possibly so into like a spaceship? Because like I would come in, you know, and be in a parachute and like, ah, so Yeah, you can, get, I've had photo shoots in here. I've had people come in and do like, I've had people from the History Wait, Channel, you make Travel sure they Channel, tell, all you? kinds of Cause, yeah, because we like it's a 27 foot parachute and a 35 foot parachute. Okay, real parachutes that's made into dresses. Okay, um, so okay, so explain that to me again what you want to do. So basically, show them a picture. picture. Sure, okay, we just did this and you're gonna, we are always and hustling like, because we have a dream and we're going to capture it. I've been chasing it all my life, and finally, without any fear, I am encouraged and empowered to capture every opportunity I have to unite in a way, all surrounded and made by a parachute. And I'll edit some of that stuff out so I don't sound so ridiculous. But anyways, you get my drift. Always hustle, always keep dreaming, always keep chasing it because I can't believe this is happening. Right. Yeah, that's, right. that's the thing. And so basically we just do some like... So you're just wanting to do a photo shoot. Yeah, like a, right, but, in, but with the parachute. We just want to make sure we can bring the parachute yes, in here. Yes, definitely. And, we, and it will be... Let me show you. I have you, contracts uh, too, so it will be in the Barnes & Noble's book. Right, because wow. we would be featured in the Barnes & Noble's book. And so that way we so, would be... We just cool want to and so we that. will like mention the location like and etc. Right, because this would be our creative extra we thing. Did, we come we in and pop it out, knock it out. We had a uh, photo contest, and these are some of the girls that did some photo shoots in there, and they oh, went, right, they went like, retro with it. Yes. Okay, so because I'd love to be a parachute in there, me and the alien, like, able to do that. This is happening right here tomorrow. Thank you so much. Okay.